Hello folks, this is Mike, PC31 The Vana Policeman and uh, it's a couple of days before Christmas, so happy Christmas to you all. Um, I've got a fantastic new box set. It should have come out on the 8th of December, but there was the, the, the manufacturers or the distributors, not too, too sure which, delayed it a week. So I got this about 10 days ago. Um, so I've been meaning to do this particular video, but uh, I wanted to show you because it's a fantastic box set. Not one which is, um, not one which I guess you'd call a must have, but um, yeah, it, it turned into a must have for me and probably a lot of others as well. And it's uh, Black Sabbath's Hand of Doom. So basically it's the um, the first eight Black Sabbath albums, the first eight with Ozzy and uh, it's what the picture discs. Um, fantastic actually, because it came in an outer box and it came in this box as well. So there was another box. This was a box in the box. Um, but look at this, absolutely fantastic. 70 to 78 on the side. It's a hefty box, really quite heavy. One of those classic boxes that Mrs. PC31 will be wanting me to throw out instantly, but I can't possibly throw this out. And look at the protection, really superb. Reminds me of the um, Led Zeppelin ones which came out, but this is probably even better actually, because you've got this great inner that protects all the corners and everything, and it comes really snug. And as I say, a box within a box. So yeah, fantastic thing. So I'm gonna have to keep that somewhere. Um, the actual box itself is absolutely beautiful. Hand of Doom. I always keep and shrink if I possibly can. So this is one of those uh, top loaders, which I was able to do it with, but yeah. Hand of Doom, here we go. That's what's on it. First eight albums, all very recognizable. Chunky box, and it is a really nice solid box as well. And there's the back, and there's the eight albums there. As I say, all picture discs. There's no book with this one. It's um, just the, the eight picture discs plus a really good double-sided poster, which I shall show you next. But yeah, a lovely, hefty, box really really good so the poster double-sided as i say one side you've got the boys way back in the day really good thick paper as well poster poster it's good really good quality and the uh the other side of this, which kind of really interesting actually, is the eight albums with all the uh, the track listings and the, and the credits. So I can imagine a lot of people going for that side actually, but they're both really good. But that's the only kind of addition with it. As I say, there's no books, hard or soft covers, whatever. Um, when I show you the actual um, picture disc, they all came in these sleeves inside. And um, I don't particularly like these. They're very cloudy and I don't totally trust them as storage. So I've swapped them all out for MoFi in the sleeves, as you'll see. So the eponymous first wonderful album. There we go. So February 1970, got to number eight in the UK. And uh, what you've got here is you've got the inverted cross where it was in the gatefold of the original. The inverted cross is on the back with um, credits and uh, Still Falls the Rain, which was on the original. Then inside, and I, th I think this is um, 180 gram, but it's very heavy, and the um, quality of the printing is very, very good. There's the actual disc itself. Front cover, back cover, well printed. I must say, or I'll say I'll keep these in, in the Mofar sleeves. I must say, whereas um, picture discs in the 80s in particular were obviously um, purely kind of decorative things, collectibles, uh, they got so much better. But this is, um, I've played several of these now, and the actual, the sonic quality, the audio quality is really good. You've still got that kind of picture disc rumble where it's not cut quite deep enough, um, but they're very pliable. But, this is a set, obviously, you wouldn't, if you didn't know Sabbath very well, 
you wouldn't buy these to be your regular records that, that you play. Um, they're primarily for collection purposes, but you can play them and they do sound pretty good. Much, much better than most picture discs you come across. The inside of the um, outer sleeve is just without the lady. And as I say, the inverted cross on the back. The interesting thing, what they've done with um, several of these is they've been quite creative with the artwork in that on some of the records, they've taken the um, poster image and put it on the back of the picture disc. Other ones, they've taken the, the gatefold image, put that on the picture disc. Anyway, we'll go through them. So second album, so Paranoid, also from 1970. So normal front cover. And that's what the back cover looks like. Inside, got a pretty plain bit there. And uh, on this one, so there we are with the front cover. And as I say, with this one, you've got the original gatefold picture they've put on the reverse. And it's really done well, as I say, very heavy quality. And the actual images are, are nice and sharp, they're really good. I was waiting for this box set for a while, actually. So I was so pleased with it when it finally dropped. Not cheap, but I think if you're a Sabbath collector, I mean, it's, it's, it's a great thing to have. So the third album from uh, 71, Master of Reality. We all know it very, very well. Same back cover. So the inner is just a straightforward purple. But the actual disc itself, you've got the front cover, Master of Reality. Looks absolutely beautiful. Hope it's picking it up okay. And then the back of it you've got the poster which came with the original master of reality so they've used that image and again done really well fantastic so the fourth album volume four which is steve at all the world's a stage i know this is his favorite sabbath album likes them all but this is his particular favorite this is just ozzy in uh, in orange and white kind of again similar to the original white on the back with the track listings inside it's beautiful there we go so aussie and orange and on the back as we all know and love aussie and white volume four and, uh, that was one which got to number one in Australia, actually, volume volume four. The Paranoid, that was the only one which I think was a UK number one. Um, a Master of Reality, that was the one which actually performed best in the, in the USA. So, fifth one, Sabbath, Bloody Sabbath. Great cover with this one. Same back as the original. And what you've got here is... The actual image comes out superb, the 666, there we go. And then on the back, you've got the inside of the original gatefold with Ozzy and the boys. Yeah, superb. As I say, volume four is um, Steve, All the World's a Stage, favorite Sabbath album. And now comes the greatest heavy rock album ever made in my opinion and um i know this is chris brophy's favorite one as well paranoid absolutely fantastic the sixth album july 1975 original front cover original back that sure the inside is is again the the cover picture replicated bill with these wonderful red his wife's tights on <laughs> <laughs> where they were kind of duped into the shot and they said that the actual photographic session this was this was just a, a dummy run and that there would be another one and there never was so they took the images from this particular session and uh look at that just i love this album greatest heavy rock album ever made in my very humble opinion and then the back that we know okay so this seventh album 
you go. So Technical Exercise from Technical C from 1976. Pretty straightforward this one. So there we go. Back cover you'd recognise. The inner. Yeah. Front cover. Simple stuff. And the actual picture disc itself. And as I say, these are decent quality to play. You can play them and enjoy them just with that little rumble in the background where it's cut shallow. But uh, there we are. This, this is a really good one, actually. Picture is so vivid. On that. These are beautiful things. Great addition to a, a Black Sabbath collection. And then the final one, Never Say Die from 78. Got to number 12. And again, the uh, the imagery on this one is superb, actually. Same back. The They've used the, um, the inners on this for the inner of the actual sleeve. And on the, oh, this one's lovely. Look at that. Wow. That is, it's, I, hope that, I hope that's coming across well. It's, it's so vivid with the, the red and the yellow, the green, the blue sky, fantastic. And then again, from the inner, they've used that for the back of the picture disc. So fantastic set, really pleased. Obviously it's one of those ones that it's not an absolute necessity, but um, for a Sabbath collection, yes, yeah, it's, it's a great addition. So uh, happy Christmas, folks. Hope you enjoyed that. And um, the next video I should post will be my top 10 of uh, 2023, which I've been toying with quite a lot. I did I did one for the half year and it's um, changed quite a lot, actually. Now I'm at the back end of the year. So, uh, so I shall be posting another one shortly. Okay, thanks, folks.